Hi, Dr. Chally. It's good to uh, be back. Thank you for having us back again this week. Thank you. Thanks for having me as well. I Absolutely. enjoy this. Absolutely. Yeah, it's been very intriguing over the past few weeks just to learn about the different hand injuries that you deal with and perform surgery on. And, um, you know, especially with uh, the different athletes uh, as well. And it's fascinating to me, um, for you being a hand surgeon, that you're also very interested in preventing the injuries. And that's very exciting. And you typically don't see a lot of physicians going in that direction, uh, especially when you're, you're a surgeon. So it really shows us where your passion is at. So it's funny you say that because it, it kind of goes against um, my job security, so to say, I love texting and typing because uh, that's job security for me because people will wear out their joints and, and get carpal tunnel, which is, which is great for the bottom line. Uh, but, but my passion really is protecting uh, people's hands uh, and minimizing pain and, and maximizing function. Uh, so protecting the hand, especially in high velocity sports, uh, is crucial. Well, yeah, you know, and it's interesting because we just covered uh, the baseball injuries that you were, um, um, had reviewed. Mm -hmm. and, um, it, it's fascinating just because of what you've been telling me about this uh, batting glove that you've been developing specifically to prevent hand injuries um, for baseball players. Uh, could you tell us a little bit more about that? So, and I certainly can. Let me give you a little bit of a sneak peek insight to the glove. Uh, it's been about two and a half years in development. And what we did was looked at the database of professional baseball players' hand injuries for about the last 20 years to see what were the major categories. And there were bony injuries as well as soft tissue injuries. So we really wanted to create a baseball glove, specifically a batting glove, that would protect players' hands from the major league level all the way down to our peewee players as they're getting into baseball. Uh, and we specifically really wanted to use cutting edge technologies uh, and test and prove them. And we were fortunate to uh, bring on a, a team to do this uh, of a Tony uh, nominated costume designer that specifically works with gloves to help us design the, uh, the glove itself. And then we utilized the UCLA Impact Labs, which is a world-renowned facility that can test our theories about protecting. So we built air cannons that shot baseballs, and we had skeleton hands wearing the glove, and pressure sensors, and high-speed film, and uh, it was two years of intense R&D to come up with a glove that will universally protect players' hands from high-speed impacts, from wild pitches or, or too, too much of an inside pitch or a, a bad swing by a, a, a batter or, or a, or a, a, a kind of tweak of the wrist. Uh, the glove will uh, avert a lot of the injuries that the players had received in years past. Uh, there hasn't been a whole lot of advancement in the batting glove. If you look at the baseball batting glove, that they wore back in the 60s and 70s. And there were a lot of players back then that just went out barehanded. Um, but today the glove really hasn't changed a whole lot. So we have patent pending designs uh, that we're very, very excited to bring uh, to the baseball community. That is very exciting. And I'm sure once the baseball players start getting a hold of this, it's gonna be very exciting for them, give them a lot more confidence and uh, also add longevity to their careers, hopefully. And, you know, even starting with Little League baseball players all the way up to the majors, it's going to really help those baseball players. Well, that was, that was one of the exciting things for us because part of the testing uh, was done with professional players. Uh, we had several pairs uh, of our prototype made and uh, brought them to some of the training camps and some of the batting cages before some of the games around town and uh, the feedback we got from some iconic iconic teams as well as players has been nothing but encouraging uh, for both players that have never had an injury and just do not want to sustain injury as well as the players that have had a hand injury 
and they've always got that in the back of their mind about getting a re-injury to the same uh, same bone or ligament. Uh, so it kind of covers two big spectrums of, of uh, players, and we're excited to uh, protect everybody. Well, that's great. That's great. So you have your prototype development right now. Uh, when are you looking to release the glove? So prototype has actually been completed. Uh, final revisions from field testing. Uh, professional college, high school players have now been reincorporated into the design. Uh, additional refinements have been made by both myself and another hand surgeon uh, who is world-renowned Dr. Uh, Charles P. Malone uh, out of New York. Uh, have provided a significant amount of insight on this. And uh, Right now, it's in final um, fabrication, and uh, by year's end, uh, you'll be able to get your hands in or on one of these pairs of gloves, that is for sure. Well, that's, that's really great. I can't wait to try one of these for myself, actually. And um, you're probably already working on the marking aspect, the names and logos and stuff. You got it. Um, would you mind if we did a poll on Facebook and uh, just allow people to um, be a part of that, choosing the name for the glove? You know, I think that would be great. Uh, my team, we've had some insight and we've narrowed it down to a few names that we really like, but uh, I'd love to hear what everybody else, uh, their thoughts are about the glove <coughs> and uh, get, get their opinions and uh, have a little uh, say in how this glove comes out and gets into to players' hands. Okay, well, that'd be great. Well, um, we'll definitely uh, post that poll then, so everybody be looking for the uh, the poll coming out this cool. week on uh, naming of the, uh, the baseball batting glove. Well, thanks again, Dr. Chalia. It's great meeting with you as always, and I uh, look forward to getting with you again uh, in the next coming week. Sounds great. Look forward to it. Thank you.